Um, my name is Freya Coombe and I'm a senior lecturer in the sports courses um, covering sports psychology, coaching and strength and conditioning. So we find that the first year it's all about getting people to the same level, so providing the basics um, of knowledge that might be if you were doing sports science in that pathway, it might be sort of the management principles, it might be coaching itself. Um, so looking at the psychology, the coaching process. And then we find that sort of in the second year, it's then a development on that theme to increasing the level and looking more analytically um, at the coaching process or at the principles of sports management. And then finally in the third year, you're much more looking to apply that to the industry. So how can you relate what you've learned in terms of the academic theory to what's going out there in practice in the environment? Yeah, one of the strengths of Bucks is that we sort of give you the skills to enable you to go out and work in that profession. So we offer sort of coaching qualifications as part of your degree package and as part of your funding. Um, so you can come in, you can study those, then you can look at how to apply what you've learnt in your lectures to that coaching scenario. So we give you those tools so that by the time you finish university you've got the knowledge and the skills to go off and sort of work in that industry. I think it's all about sort of keeping up with the latest developments in the industry and um, we want to send a lot more of our students off to gain experience of coaching so again working with our new partnerships with the um, school sports partnerships in the local area so can we sort of get the students involved with going into schools um, and working in there to get an experience of how you know the delivery of sport actually works rather than just sort of reading about it in the textbooks actually bringing it to life and they can see that where will the funding from the government goes how, it, how that money's spent and what effect it has actually on the children. A lot of our students also sort of go into sports development, working as either football development officers or county sports development officers. Um, so I think coaching is a big industry. Um, since the professionalisation of the industry, there are a lot more sort of opportunities out there for people to get paid employment and also full-time employment, not just sort of part-time evenings and weekends, which is what it used to be like.